real estate agents often take the position with a home seller that price is everything and everything boils down to your price. It should be your first consideration. And price is important. There's no doubt about that. You can't get $400,000 for something that's worth $300,000. But it's not the only thing and it's probably not the first thing that a seller should be thinking about. There's really four things that you have control over when you market at your property for sale. First, um, the amount of preparation that goes into getting it ready for the market. A little bit of paint, some cleaning, some, some decluttering, that kind of thing. Secondly, the presentation of the property to the market. You know, is it professionally done with professional photos and, um, and, and other tools that are useful today? Thirdly, promotion. Um, how well exposed is this property to the, the general market? That's a huge thing today. And then finally, the price. If those first three items are executed professionally and well, they will support a higher price. And conversely, if you don't put any effort into preparing the home for sale, uh, it's poorly presented to the market, and nobody knows it's for sale, you certainly can't expect to get a peak price. So focus on the first three items first. Those will support, your, support a higher price, and your price basically becomes the final lever to get a sale. If you've prepared the house properly, if it's presented beautifully, if the market's well aware that it's for sale and it's not selling, then, and only then, is it time to adjust the price.